you can refer to them by any name. Emergency firearms, compact rifles, safety weapons or survival rifles. But in a critical situation, you'll undoubtedly be grateful to possess one. Numerous options are accessible, but they all share a core design philosophy. Each is a streamlined rifle that can be disassembled and tucked away in a boat, ATV, small aircraft or even a backpack. However, before we dive into the options, there's a distinction we'd like to draw. A survival rifle shouldn't be confused with a truck or trunk firearm. While there's potential for overlap in their use, these aren't primarily crafted for self-defense. To assist you in making an informed choice, we've compiled a list of the top five scout rifles, highlighting their essential features and considerations to ensure you select the one that's right for you. For a comprehensive analysis and a handy comparison tool, visit our website at allaboutsurvival.com. Number 5. Tikka T3X Arctic The Tikka brand, initially under Oi Tikkaboski AB, saw its T3X model crafted by Sako Oi, following a merger in the 1980s. Notably, Sako has been recognized for its precise rifles since the 1920s, a reputation built from refining the Soviet Mosin rifle. Though not all finished Mosins were Sako's handiwork, they stood out for their unparalleled precision, thanks to enhanced barrels and an improved stock to receiver fit. In the post-continuation war period, Sako shifted its focus to hunting rifles. These rifles, though prevalent during the Cold War, didn't serve in the military. Nevertheless, by the 1990s, Sako had introduced the TRG series of sniper rifles, capturing the international market and replacing the TKIV in the FDF lineup. Around the same period, the Sako 85 was launched and the Tikka brand was rejuvenated to offer the same precision, but in a more budget-friendly and simpler manufacturing process. By 2015, Sako was well positioned to contend for the new Canadian Ranger rifle. Their extensive experience with wooden stocks and adherence to military specifications, especially from the Sako TRG series, gave them the edge. Their unique approach, like maintaining superior iron sights in their rifles, was a distinctive feature. Drawing parallels between the C-19's front sight and a TRG showcases this legacy. Tikka incorporated minor tweaks, such as an enhanced trigger guard and a larger bolt handle, aligning with its more affordable branding. This economic advantage, coupled with the existing infrastructure to produce the C-19 components, perhaps tipped the scales in their favor. The culmination of this rich history is the C-19, arguably today's premier iron-sighted outdoor rifle. Its intelligent design, suited for harsh conditions, coupled with a tradition of precision, resonates well with users. While the Canadian Rangers have voiced minimal grievances, mostly about it not being semi-auto, the C-19's lightweight, reliable and handy nature make it a force to reckon with. Number 4. Ruger American Ranch The Ruger American Ranch rifle stands as an economical and versatile bolt action with a 16-inch barrel, available in multiple calibers. Depending on the selected caliber, the rifle weighs between 5.5 and 6 pounds. While it primarily features a tan stock juxtaposed with a matte black receiver and barrel, there are also unique colors available through certain distributors. The ranch title from the Ruger dates back to the early 1980s, linked with versions of the Ruger Mini 14 tailored for scope rings. Interestingly, one of these models was my inaugural rifle purchase. Currently, the available chain rings for the RARR include 5.56, 6.5 Grendel, 300 BLK, 7.62 by 39, 350 Legend, and 450 Bushmaster. True to the Ruger American tradition, these rifles are equipped with the Ruger Marksman 3 to 5 pound adjustable trigger and a 3 lug dual locking Karn 70 degree centerfire bolt. They come with a Picatinny rail scope base, a block bedded receiver, and a free floated barrel. This suite of features, coupled with its affordable price point, underscores its impressive value. It's this value that influenced my decision to acquire the 300 Blackout version, particularly the Flush Fit Magazine RARR, at a rate substantially less than its $549 MSRP for all chamberings. In evaluating the 300 BLK Ruger American Ranch Rifle, it offers commendable value. 
From an objective standpoint, it boasts compactness, accuracy, and a lightweight, precise, adjustable trigger. Its barrel length is aptly calibrated for its caliber, and it includes both a threaded barrel and a factory-provided Picatinny rail base. From a personal perspective, it's an ideal companion for rough and tumble environments like trucks, tractors, or four-wheelers, and can serve as an economical hunting rifle, especially for newcomers. If you're scouting for an affordable and accurate bolt action, the Ruger American Ranch Rifle warrants consideration. However, do keep an eye out for issues related to the flush fit magazine models. Number 3. Mossberg Bolt Action MVP Scout Within the spectrum of scout rifles, Mossberg has introduced a multi-purpose bolt action rifle aptly designed for a variety of uses. Having been an owner of the Mossberg Scout for roughly four years, I've employed it as a backup rifle, a primary test gun, and notably during nocturnal hunts for wild pigs. From these experiences, I can vouch for its superior performance. The rifle comes equipped with a robust polymer stock, a functional recoil pad, and short weaver-style rails positioned on both sides of the forward stock. A nearly conventional Picatinny rail system is also present, making it compatible with advanced night scopes, magnification tools, and a birdcage flash suppressor. This suppressor can be conveniently replaced with an alternative suppressor through the use of an adapter ring. My rifle, being compact and transport friendly, snugly fits inside a pickup or a Can-Am side-by-side. -side. It utilizes a dependable 10-round detachable box magazine. Over its lifetime, I've experimented with multiple 308 cartridges like Federal, Black Hills, SIG, and Winchester. With it, I've researched wind drift effects using varying bullet shapes and weights firing up to 400 yards on steel targets. Its resilient design showcases the rifle's broad range of capabilities. Priced at an MSRP of $623, the Mossberg Scout Rifle gives a bang for your buck. It boasts a 16.25-inch barrel, a 10 plus 1 magazine capacity, a 1 to 10-inch barrel twist rate, a sleek matte blue finish, and a black synthetic stock. The rifle has an overall length of 37.5 inches and is chambered for the classic 308 Winchester and 7.62 NATO rounds. The front sight is sheltered with a true glow casing, whereas the rear sight is of a receiver type. The rails, receiver, and barrel elements are crafted from robust steel and precisely CNC machined according to military specifications. Having toured the production facility, I can personally attest to the impeccable craftsmanship, although some details about these rifles remain classified. Number two. Steyr Scout The Steyr Scout stands out as the epitome of commercial scout rifles. Unlike other rifles that are mere variants of their parent company's lineup, the Steyr Scout is a unique creation, the result of a 10-year partnership with Jeff Cooper, specifically crafted to meet the scout rifle definition. Boasting a 19-inch fluted cold hammer forged barrel, the Steyr Scout maintains an overall length of 38.6 inches and weighs a mere 6.6 .6 pounds straight out of the box. Distinctively, among the five rifles discussed, its stock lacks checkering on the pistol grip and forearm. However, the stock is textured throughout. It's equipped with five push and twist sling swivel points, offering flexibility to add a ching sling on the rifles either side. A unique addition is its nearly concealed bipod integrated into the stock, which remains inconspicuous until activated. Moreover, the stock's rear part can store an additional five round magazine. The rifle also comes with two length of pull spacers for customization. Designed with the vision of utilizing a low magnification, forward set scope for accurate, both eyes open shooting, the Steyr scope ensures precision. If primary optics malfunction, primary ghost ring iron sights embedded in the rail come to the rescue. Yet, if preferred, a traditional scope can be mounted. For testing, the rifle was equipped with a Burris 2-7X32 Scout scope. The rifle includes two 5-round magazines that are double-stacked with a staggered feed. Remarkably, their 2-inch height ensures they sit flush with the stock. The magazines offer dual insertion modes. The first catch essentially acts as a magazine cutoff, allowing manual cartridge feeding. A gentle push will seat the magazine fully, enabling auto-feed. Magazine release is achieved by pressing tabs located on the magazines both sides. For those who prefer higher ammunition capacity, a high-capacity conversion kit is available, boosting the capacity to 20 rounds. Safety is paramount with a three-tier system on the Steyr Scout. The fire settings is marked by a red dot. 
The initial safe setting deactivates the firing mechanism while permitting bolt cycling. The subsequent safe mode immobilizes the bolt. In this mode, the bolt can be pressed against the stock, ensuring the firing mechanism is securely locked. Manipulating the safety's release tab allows transition between modes. The bolt handle, round and smooth, is notably the most substantial among the four rifles, measuring nearly an inch at its broadest. For those keen on aesthetics, the Steyr Scout offers choices in black, gray, mud, or green finishes. Number 1. Springfield Armory M1A SOCOM 16 The rifle measures an overall length of 37.5 inches and has an empty weight of 8.8 .8 pounds. It possesses a 16.5 inch barrel with a 1 to 11 twist rate and includes an integrated muzzle brake, aiding in countering the recoil from the 308 Winchester chambering. However, it's quite noisy. Always wear hearing protection. The M1A offers a version in 6.5 Creedmoor. Despite its substantial weight, the rifle's balance and shortened barrel make it agile and intuitive to handle. It boasts an aperture rear sight and a tritium highlighted front post, a thoughtful detail. Given the M1A SOCOM 16's design for closer engagements, the rear aperture is slightly enlarged, yet the rifle can effectively target several hundred yards away. If you're considering a side-mounted scope, Note the receiver's left side is drilled and tapped for this purpose, but this would negate the use of stripper clips. Although detachable box magazines are available, the use of stripper clips is subjective. The rifle's magazines operate similarly to the M14, rocking in with a release tab. It comes with a 10-round magazine, but 20-round versions are also up for grabs, and it's compatible with surplus magazines. Modern features include a Picatinny rail ahead of the receiver, perfect for attaching a red dot or a long eye relief scope. Its accuracy has been described as excellent when using match ammo at 100 yards, paired with a 2-7x LER scope. The rifle reportedly handles smoothly and offers minimal kickback for a 308 caliber. Many favor the zero magnification red dot on this model. The robust action incorporates a sturdy rotating bolt powered by the M14-like gas piston and long operating rod. The bolt design mirrors the M14 which in turn was inspired by the legendary M1 Garand. The substantial trigger group and the takedown procedure are reminiscent of the M14. Notice a recurring theme. The easily accessible safety is integrated into the trigger guard. The rifle's trigger offers a consistent pull slightly below 6 pounds and it's described as very crisp with a swift reset. A bolt stop tab is present on the receiver's left side. The SOCOM 16 features a polymer stock and handguard. There is noticeable checkering on the lower handguard and pistol grip. The polymer butt pad, resembling the M14's design, has a hinge plate meant to rest atop their shoulder for enhanced stability. This plate can be lifted to reveal storage for a cleaning kit. The stock lacks a comb, and for optimal cheek weld and eye relief with optics, some users opt for an attachable cheek rest. That concludes our roundup of top scout rifles. If you found this video informative, a thumbs up would be greatly appreciated. Which scout rifle caught your eye? Share your thoughts in the comments section below.